During the 14th annual India-Russia summit in Moscow, the Kremlin reaffirmed its strong support of India's bid to become a permanent member of that council. CCTV's Daria Bounderchuk reports from Moscow. Russian President Vladimir Putin and India's Prime Minister Manmohan Singh discussed several pressing international issues, such as the conflict in Syria and the troop withdrawal from Afghanistan in 2014. In a joint statement signed during their meeting, the leaders reaffirmed the time-tested friendship the two have shared for decades and ability to work together at various multilateral platforms, including the UN, G20 and BRICS. We are working together in the political sphere and are active participants in the UN within the BRICS framework. The Russian and Indian leaders also discussed trade, economic ties and energy cooperation, which is a vital part of bilateral relations. The first energy block of the nuclear power plant Kudang Kulam, launched back in July, was effectively linked to India's energy system on Monday. For India, energy security is very, very important. And obviously, given the kind of energy resources that Russia has, Russia will play a very important role. And given the kind of closeness that Russia has, there are several proposals on the table, including uh, some about developing new routes to deliver Russian uh, oil and gas to India. However, experts stress the two countries need to focus on building and expanding transport infrastructure, not only for hydrocarbons, in order to boost bilateral trade and goods exchange. We don't have a reliable transport route. And that is a major obstacle to uh, developing uh, good economic relations. Defense issues were also on the agenda, as India is one of Russia's chief weapons buyer. Next month, Russia will hand over the long-awaited Vikramaditya aircraft carrier to India's Navy. Moscow and Delhi elevated their strategic ties and agreed to coordinate their efforts in promoting stability in the region. The foreign ministers of the two countries are scheduled to meet with their Chinese counterpart in November in Delhi for further consultations on regional security. Larry Bondarchuk, CCTV, Moscow.